Hi, today we will understand about the users and the groups in Linux. The every user is assigned a unique user ID in Linux. The user ID, the UIDs and the usernames are stored in etc passwd file. You can verify etc passwd. So as you can see here, these are the users. This is the password. This is the UID the user id and this is a group well same as in windows user cannot read write or execute each of the files without permission So now let's talk about the groups. Well, each group is assigned. Sorry, users are assigned to groups. Each group is assigned a unique group ID, which is usually known as GID. And GIDs are stored in etc group. So let's go and verify. So as you can see here, these are the groups and these, these are the GID, group ID. And remember in Linux, each user is given their own private group. It means that root has a unique root group. If you are creating a Linux user or ATC whatever it will be assigned a unique with the same name let's suppose let me create a user user add abcd so you can verify cat cat etc pass to purity So now as you can see here, sorry, cat, so as you can see here this is the username, this is its home directory and it's also assigned a ABCD group you can verify 504 you can see here 504 is ABCD group so in Linux whenever you create a, a group or whenever you create a user it's assigned to a unique group with the same name and with the unique GID and with the unique user ID.